What's going on guys, T-Mart here, and today I wanted to talk about the two bonuses that you get for pre-ordering Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. One of which is a golden weapon that you never have to reload. Yes, that's right, it is pretty freaking cool. So, uh, anyway, the gameplay you're seeing on screen is gameplay from the single player trailer that just came out for this game. If you guys haven't seen my video on that, make sure you guys check it out. I will link it down in the description as well as annotated on screen. But uh, anyway, let's talk about these bonuses. So, uh, what you get for pre-ordering this game is the Advanced Arsenal pack which comes with two different things so the first one is the bullet brass exosuit which you can see right here it basically turns the back of your character his exoskeleton suit uh, into like this you know brass bullet shell casing color you know it's almost like a gold so you know that's kind of cool if you want like a, a golden kind of uh, you know exosuit to, uh, to you know stick out and be unique in multiplayer then there you go you've got it now the second thing that comes with this advanced arsenal pack is the uh, the, the bullet brass M1 quantum now the M1 quantum is a weapon in multiplayer player and the bullet brass version is obviously just kind of like a, a you know skinned weapon a, a camo that makes it into that you know brassy goldy color which is uh, which is pretty cool as well now the thing that's kind of special about this is they told us about the m1 quantum in this pre-order bonus video that they put out and this thing is actually very very unique so this is a directed energy weapon that runs off of a battery so you, you have to manage how fast and how often you use it because you don't want it to overheat and you don't want to deplete the battery and you know make it run out but as long as you can control those two things and you're, you know, smart about it and you aren't laying on the trigger constantly, if you can master that, uh, they said that you have a weapon that you never have to reload. Like, the, the, this N1 Quantum is something that it literally never runs out of bullets. You just have to make sure it doesn't overheat, which is kind of cool. You know, I don't know. I thought that was pretty unique, and, and it's kind of cool that they're giving us kind of like a, a golden version of that weapon uh, if you pre-order the game. So, uh, yeah, those are the two things that come with this. If you pre-order the game, you get those for free. So, you know, it's kind of cool, but uh, I'd be interested to see what you guys have to say about this. You know, I put out a video a couple of weeks ago that, you know, kind of talked about... Uh, a survey that Activision sent out that was asking about, you know, potential pre-order bonuses and, you know, what people thought. And a lot of you guys responded. Thank you for that. We had like 35 or 40,000 responses, which is literally crazy. But I think the one that was, you know, by far the most is most people wanted to see Nuketown come back in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. And then the second one was, uh, I think, you know, early access to where you could play multiplayer online a little bit early. And then I think after that might have been the, uh, the beta. Uh, those two were pretty close. So, uh, yeah, this isn't, you know, the end-all be-all. You know, this probably isn't the only thing we're going to get for Pruder in the game, but it could be. You know, I, I don't know. What do you guys think about that? Like, are you happy with this Pruder bonus? Would you have liked to see Nuketown come back? Would you have liked to see, uh, you know, a, a new map come back? You know, these are just two cosmetic changes. You know, that's all it is. It, it's not like a special weapon or a special map or, or anything like that. Like, I remember uh, back in World at War, we got the, was it the FG-32? was like this special weapon just for Pruder people. I thought that was kind of cool, uh, and I'd like to see something like that come back. But yeah, as of now, it's just kind of like a, a little skin for your exosuit and then a new camo for the, uh, the, the M1 Quantum uh, assault rifle, I guess I'm going to call it. I don't know, the direct energy weapon. So uh, let me know what you guys think about that. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Make sure you guys check out the trailer. If you guys haven't seen that yet, click the annotation on screen or the link down in the description. And we'll catch you all later. Thanks again, guys. Catch you all later. Peace out.